The Quran claims that Allah made the earth as it is today in six days. This is wrong. There is no scientific debate whatsoever about creationism, as shown by the complete absence of articles supporting it in scientific publications. This video explains why. But first, the evidence. 1. Surely your Lord is Allah, who created the heavens and the earth in six days. 2. Six days, again. 3. Six days, again. 4. Six days, again. 5. Six days, yet again. There is no reason to believe that this is a metaphor other than not wanting the Quran to be wrong. Even if the days discussed are 1,000 years or 50,000 years, as some who look at these surahs suggest, the Quran is wrong about the Earth's timeline by billions of years. And the Quran repeats many stories from the Bible, so it is reasonable to believe it is repeating, in less detail, the story of Genesis, which wrongly claims man was created on the sixth day. The main way scientists have proven beyond reasonable doubt that the Earth is around 4.5 billion years old is radioactive dating. Some forms, or isotopes, of elements like uranium, carbon and potassium are radioactive and they decay at a steady rate. This steady rate can be used reliably to estimate the age of rocks. For example, Uranium decays into lead very slowly, so if a rock has more uranium than lead, it's younger, and if there's more lead than uranium, it's older. Scientists use this to discover the Earth's oldest known rock was about 4.5 billion years old. This is beyond debate. This doesn't necessarily disprove the Quran, because some claim Allah could have made the Earth as it is today 4.5 billion years ago. However, we know from radioactive dating of fossils that life, in the form of simple microbes in the sea, only started around 3.7 billion years ago. We know that the first land animals, insects, only moved to the land around 500 million years ago. We know that dinosaurs went extinct 65 million years ago. We know that millions of species existed in the past that no longer exist today, and we know that millions of species today did not exist in the past, which proves evolution. Amongst these new species is Homo sapiens, or humans. All of this definitively proves the Quran is wrong to say Allah made the earth as it is today in six days. Therefore, Muslims should not believe in the perfect truth of the Qur'an.